Look at the lovely picture I've drawn for you, my dear Show friend. Me. It's beautiful. See for yourself. <gasps> You've it, drawn a picture? It? When did you draw it? What did you draw? Show me, show me, show me, show me, show me. All right, all right. Here it is. Look at it. <gasps> wow. Right You've drawn a river? It's beautiful. Uh, There's also a mountain. Have uh, you seen one before? Where mm -hmm. have you seen it if you have? Mm -hmm. Whom were you with? Were you alone? Uh, uh, no, no. You must have been with Mr. Neighbor, huh? You couldn't uh, have managed uh, to go there uh, alone. Uh, or perhaps you've uh, seen uh, it on TV. Have you? Uh, have you? Quiet for a second, yes. my dear hot hot. Yes. Let me get a word in. You're constantly chattering and don't let me answer huh? you, do you? Come answer on. me. Answer me. What did I ask that requires an answer? I just wondered if you've seen a mountain before. Have you seen one? Uh. Have you? Have you? Have you? Have you? Have you? Yes, yes, huh? yes. I have. I have a beautiful tall mountain in the very really? distance. Really? You've seen a beautiful mountain in the distance? Where exactly? Is it the same oh. beautiful mountain that I saw? Yes, it must be the same mountain. Oh. Or maybe another one. Why don't oh. you answer me? Answer me, answer me, answer me, answer me! You're not giving me a chance to! Huh? Never mind. Oh. The sun is also very beautiful. The sun in your drawing is very beautiful. How do you know the sun is yellow? Whenever guys, I see the sun, I sometimes guys, feel it might be guys. white or, I don't know, a color similar to that. Hot, hot. I'm not really... Squirrel. Mr. Nabel, yes. I'm not finished yet. Uh, Excuse uh, me. Say, Squirrel, when on. I look at the sun, it looks white. And it's uh -huh. so bright that it blinds me. I can't look at it for so long. How do you know uh, it's yellow, uh, huh? Just tell me that. Hot, uh, hot. Hold on a second, Mr. Nabel. I have to say something. I really wish I hadn't shown this drawing to you. You made me regret huh? it. Why do you talk so huh? much? You chatter and chatter and chatter. Huh? What's so wrong with you, huh? Guys, can I say something now? Yes. What is it? Oh. What? Hot, hot. Yes. Squirrel. Oh. Do you remember I asked you to do me a favor once? Uh, oh, I know, I know. No. What you said about Let fixing talk, the van? Let me talk, will you? Where is it? Uh. Did you fix it? Mm, no, a little before that. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You said about the weather, that it's not that warm, right, right? No. A little before that. Uh-huh. You said about the fan that you wanted to fan yourself? Mr. Neighbor, it's asking us to be quiet so that he can study. <gasps> but I was quiet. I didn't peck the tree even once. Not even once. Perhaps he's talking about you. Yes, that's it. When you went home, the sound of your footsteps was really loud and distracted <sighs> Mr. Neighbor. <sighs> the sound of it? my footsteps? Yes, yes. I didn't peck the tree after all. Not a sound came out of me. But you made a lot of noise when you went home. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about Squirrel's footsteps. I'm no. talking about what we agreed on earlier. You promised to talk mm -hmm. quietly, play quietly, so that I can mm -hmm. study. Do you remember? Yes, yes, yes. I yes, said yes, it was yes. stuffy inside the house, and I can study better when I'm outside. And you promised to talk quietly sure. so that I can study. I have an exam, guys. Help me out, okay. please. Okay. okay? Yes. Or yes, if you yes, have a no. problem with that, I could always go back no, inside, no, no, you know. No, 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 no. no. Please, don't say Are you sure? That. Go ahead and resume your studies. You might become a doctor one day. You may become an important person one day. You may invent something. Yes, if you study hard, many good things can happen to you in the future. By the way, what is the book uh, you're reading about? I'd really like uh, to know what's written there. Enough, Hot Hot. Why do you talk so much? Oh, me? When did I talk? I have nothing to say. When did I talk? Did I say something? You're hot, giving hot. me a headache, honestly. Oh, my head, my huh? head, my hot, head. Hot, hot. Why do you talk so much? Be quiet, huh? will you? Don't talk so much. Bring your voice down a bit. All right. Oh. It's okay if you ask me that. I never said oh. I wouldn't be quiet. I wanted to talk in order to encourage you to talk as well. Why are you hot, asking hot, me to hot, shut hot, up anyway? Hot, hot, oh. hot, hot. Please yes. be quiet. Be quiet, hot, hot. Please, I beg you, be quiet. Oh. <laughs> Why have you become so talkative today? I didn't know talking too much would bother others to this extent. I swear I have a severe headache. I am not feeling well at all. I don't know what to say or, or do when you're talking. So be All right. All right. All right. <sighs> you want me to stop talking? You want me to keep 
quiet. Yes. But, but I'll get bored uh. to death that way. I'll get sad and unhappy. I think I'll have to go somewhere else. No, no. If you don't love me, I can leave and go somewhere else. If you don't want to hear my voice, I'll just leave. No, oh, no, hot. no, look. No. Let me talk to Mr. Neighbor. Look, yes. my dear, um, no need to get offended. I've always okay. loved to hear you talk honest. But... But today, you're talking a little bit more than usual. Let me make uh, uh, one thing uh, clear. Uh, I'm not crying. I just have a lump in my throat. All right, no need to be but sad. what's wrong with me talking a bit too much, huh? Look, uh, we don't uh, want you to get upset with us. Excuse me, Mr. Neighbor. Go on. Let me talk to him. Uh, look, when you talk too much, we get a strange feeling in our stomachs mm. and our heads. Forgive me for being so... Yes, he's you. right. Talking too much is not a good thing. We don't want you to get upset with us. We don't want you to leave. You know very well that we really love you, but you need to know when it's time to talk and when it's time to keep quiet. You need to talk when you're asked a question, and you need to ask a question when you're curious about something. There's no need to just open your mouth and let the words come out whenever you want, right? People will love you more if you only talk when you're required to. But... but I really love to talk! I want us to talk to each other and just talk and talk and talk yes, and talk. Yes, um, yes. Oh, uh, that's but, not but good. We know you love to yes. talk. Yes, <laughs> but as I said, okay. it's not right to talk whenever you feel like talking. We love the hot hot who knows when to talk and when to keep quiet. Not the one who keeps chattering our heads off all day long whenever he feels like it. Mm -hmm. All right. Exactly right, all right. I used to think talking too much will bring us closer, you know? No, 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 that's not yeah. true. We're already close enough as it is. <laughs> you know that. I just want to ask a favor if you don't mind. Yes, please, yes. please, please, don't talk yes, too much, of can you? Of yes, course, of course. No problem. <laughs> do you mean that? Yes, yes we of do. Course. Don't, don't worry. worry. <laughs> well, I certainly hope so. Now, if you don't mind, I'll go okay. back to my studies. Go okay, ahead. okay, of course. Of if we talk wisely, everyone will listen to us attentively. If we say stupid things, everyone will get upset with us. If we talk too much and too loudly, people will get a headache. If we talk very little, they may think we're upset with them. My mom says I can say whatever I want whenever I want. My mom once told me something in confidence, but I said all of it at a party. My mom was really upset. One day my father was talking to his friends. I kept calling him to take me to the park and buy me a toy car. My friend got really upset with me. Don't you know you shouldn't interrupt others? I don't talk much when my grandma visits our house because she easily gets a headache. Being talkative is not a good thing. Being rude is not a good thing either. My dad says a Muslim should listen more in order to learn more. We too should say things that make others happy and earn praise for us. It's the best thing to do. Whenever our dear prophet and imams talked, people learned many good things from what they said. A Muslim should say good things, things that are informative and productive. We shouldn't say stupid things or interrupt others, because we want God to be happy with us. Yes, yes, hello, sorry. No, I, I couldn't hear you properly, it's better now. Yes, go on, that's right. Yes, that's right. Mr. Uh, uh, Thank you for calling me back, I really appreciate it. I was waiting for your call. I really wanted to talk to you about that job. Could you tell me what my job description would be? What do I actually have to do in the job? Thank you, yes, that's right, I am. I can do all the things you mentioned. Sorry, your voice is breaking up. Would you mind repeating that, please? Yes. What is it? Why is Mr. Neighbor behaving like that? Why doesn't he answer your question mm, about watering I the agree. plants? I agree. No, I just, um... Mr. Neighbor, I'm, I'm sorry, could you repeat that? Sometimes. 
Don't you think so? Mm, yes, you're right. Uh, Excuse yeah, me. but could you repeat Who's that one more time? Well, Sorry, well, I'm in a bad area right now. There's hardly tell any me, network. There's me. no coverage on my phone. <sighs> could you please tell me one more time? Uh-huh. Thank you. Tell and what's me. the address and which neighborhood tell are you guys me. in? Uh-huh, yes. Uh, hot, hot. I yes. Think he wants me to water them. Right? I know it very well. Let me see, let me see. Ask him again and let me You're see. You're absolutely right. Hurry up, hurry up. Oh, watch his reaction. Go on. No, Mr. I wasn't neighbor, told you. I, I, I didn't flowers. mean to be rude. You're right. Yes, you yes. Want to yes. Water it. Water it. It's a bit crowded here. It's yeah, very, very, very crowded. Um, could you yeah, just give me one idea. more second? Could you tell me one more time? Uh, I would be very grateful if you could just tell me one uh, more time. Hmm. I think he shook his head. Yes, yes. It yes. Seems so. uh, uh, I agree with I you. Think he yes, yes. Want me to water them. Yeah. I, I'm very smart. Uh, I'm a quick neighbor. learner. Definitely. I understood me? what you said. Uh, I just asked I you to explain to one more time. Hello, 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 hello. What is it? What is his answer? He hung up on me. Why what is it with you guys today? Me? Why are you so loud? What's wrong with uh, you? What is in my hand right now? Can you tell me what it is, please? Let me what see. is it? it what I, is it? What is it? It's a phone. It's a phone. It's yes. a phone. Well done. When I'm talking on the phone, I'm talking on the phone. It means I'm talking to someone on the line. And you shouldn't interrupt me because uh -huh. then he won't hear me. Yes. And even if he does, I won't be able to hear him. Huh? Right? Do you understand? You shouldn't interrupt yes, me yes, then. Yes, that's right. Yes, you're right. Uh, we saw the phone. So in why did you keep hand. interrupting me then? I didn't hear a thing. Why are you so mad, Mr. No, I'm not Neighbor? mad. Come on, oh, it's okay. Yeah, no, I'm mad. not. But you need to know for but next you time. Know what you should do. Excuse Go on. me. The hot hot has yes, to me. I do. Go you on. You could have talked to us for a bit and then to the other person. You could have answered Well, that's not both possible. Of us. What's wrong with that? That wasn't possible. When I'm talking on the phone, you need to wait for me to hang up the phone before talking to me oh. because then I can't hear a word what uh -huh. he's saying. I can neither understand you nor the uh, other person who's on the line. Um, well, I didn't know you can't talk to both me and the person on the other end of your phone, did I? Mm. I didn't know. That's right, Mr. Neighbor. Was it really terrible? Well, no, not really. But it didn't end well either for me. I lost a good job opportunity. Oh. It doesn't matter. I just hope you've learned uh -huh. once and for all not to interrupt two people when they're talking on the phone or when they're talking Do with each other. Do you want me to call him and say how skilled you are at many things? Would you like me to do that? No, it's all right. Don't uh, worry about uh, it. I'll sort Mr. it out. Neighbor, yes, squirrel. Uh, can I say something? Please give me your phone and I will tell them it was my fault because I was interrupting you and distracting uh -huh. you. We all need to remember that when somebody's talking on the phone, we yeah. shouldn't interrupt them. Because they may lose their trail of thought yes, and forget what they right. were about to say. Just as we expect others to listen to us attentively when we're talking, yes. we need to do the same for them. Don't we, hot hot and squirrel? So? And mm -hmm. refrain from interrupting others when they are talking. Oh, talking. Yes, you're right. Yes, well done. Distract them. Right. Mm, like what I did today. It's quite all right. You didn't know after all. What's important yes. is that you know from now on, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Besides, mm -hmm. I've learned many things today. I've learned not to talk too much. Well done. Not to talk at inappropriate Very good. times. Not to interrupt others. Lovely. Excuse me, when am I supposed to do uh -huh. that? <laughs> I see. When it's the right time. You need to find out when the right uh -huh. time is to talk. And you need to decide that for yourself. Okay, okay. Well done. I'll be very careful from now on and I apologize to you, Mr. Neighbor. I promise never to do something like that to you again. It's all ever, right. Ever, no ever. big Not deal. Anymore. I'd better call that manager again and see if I can arrange for that interview. Uh, answer tell my me, question tell first, me. though. Should I water the flower pots or not? Is that the only question you want to ask me right now? Uh, no, okay, go no, on. No, I've got another question too. Uh, are we going on a picnic uh -huh. today or not? Yes. Well, about your first question. Don't water the flowers because I already did that this morning. About your second okay, mm -hmm. question. If I succeed in talking to the manager and he agrees to give me the job, not only will we go on a picnic, mm -hmm. but I'll also invite you to a nice dinner at my house tonight. Okay, let's see. let's make this call. Guys, quiet. Let me make the phone call. Come on, guys. Guys! Squirrel, shh. God is kind. God is powerful. God is wise. 
You can see it in everything he's created. You only need to look at them carefully. Like me. I looked carefully. Look for yourself. Dear Lord, we thank you for your kindness, for your power, and for your intelligence. I'm really glad to be your creature. Well, 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 look, it's our wonder chest and it's open already. <laughs> let's see what it's got for us today. Come on out. Ooh, let's yeah. see what you have. Mm, look How's at this lovely out? turtle. Oh, you wow. so have Right, so let you. me close the door. Let's put them all here. Uh, uh, uh. Mm -hmm. Are you guys ready for today's story? We are. Yeah. Go on. Great. Here we go then. Once upon a time, far, far, far away, was a pond in the jungle in which two beautiful ducks lived. They were friends with a turtle who had lived there for a very long time. After a while, the water in the pond started to go down. A drought was coming. The duck had to leave that place and find a pond with more water because they couldn't live without water. The turtle was really sad because he didn't have wings to fly with and go with them. He was losing his dearest friends. The turtle told them, Are you really going? You're my only friends. I can't live here without you. You're going to fly away, but I don't have any wings. Yes, the turtle didn't have wings to go with them. One of the ducks told him, We'd better not leave and stay here with Turtle. We shouldn't go anywhere. The other duck said, No, no, I have a better idea. We should try to teach Turtle how to fly, or better yet, build a pair of wings for him so that he can accompany us. That was a great idea. They decided to make wings for the turtle so that he could go with them. The ducks went to the jungle and gathered some leaves, sticks and other things that they believed were suitable for making feathers for him. They brought their find for the turtle to make the wings. They said to the cute turtle, Hello, my dear friend. Why are you so sad? Is something wrong? No, there's nothing wrong. I'm just sad at the idea of being left alone. He was really upset about being left alone. But the ducks had a great suggestion for him. They told him, No, we're not going to leave our dear friend alone. We have decided to take you with us. Here, let us attach this leaf to your hand. It's time you come with us. Yes! Mm-hmm. That day, they tried to teach the turtle how to fly. They tied all the leaves and sticks to his hands and feet and made him practice flying. But no matter how hard they tried, it was of no use. The turtle couldn't fly with those leaves and sticks. The turtle was really sad. He told them, What? Are you seriously asking me to fly with these leaves? But how? I don't know how to fly. Hmm. No matter what they did, it was of no use. The next day, the ducks came up to the turtle. This time, the turtle had an idea for them. As soon as he saw them, he said, My dear friends, I have an idea. You can pick up a stick with your bills and I can take hold of it. Then, when you fly, you can take me with you. It wasn't a bad idea. The turtle believed that if they took the two ends of the stick in their mouths and began to fly, he could hold on to it with his mouth and go with them. One of the ducks told him, 
How are you gonna take hold of the stick with your mouth? Hmm. The other duck, who was really surprised, said, "How are you going to manage that?" The turtle answered him, "Well, I'll take hold of the middle of the stick with my mouth." And you start to fly. Nothing's gonna happen. Don't worry. The ducks wondered if they could actually do that. Can we really take the turtle with us while we're flying? They said. What's gonna happen? Can we really take him with us? Won't he fall down? Well, I'll take hold of the middle of the stick with my mouth, and you start to fly. Nothing's gonna happen.、Mm -hmm. The turtle said nothing would happen, but guys, the ducks weren't really sure they could take him with them. Could they really get a stick and fly away together as the turtle had suggested? Hmm. One of the ducks said, "What's gonna happen? Can we really take him with us? Won't he fall down?" Hmm. The other duck said. We should tell him to take a firm hold on the stick and not talk under any circumstances. Even if someone talks to him, he shouldn't reply. Yes, they decided to find a stick. The two ducks were going to hold up the two ends of the stick, and the turtle was going to take hold of the middle of it with his teeth and not open his mouth once they were flying in the sky. He promised not to talk under any circumstances. They found the stick and put both ends of it in their beaks, and the turtle took hold of it with his teeth. The ducks began to fly and were soon up in the sky. When they were flying over the city, people watched them pass by and waved their hands. Many of them were surprised at seeing a flying turtle. They couldn't believe their eyes. There was a little boy watching them from down below. <laughs> The turtles fly, and how ridiculous! <laughs> The turtle felt really insulted. He had to answer him. He just couldn't keep quiet. He said, "That's none of your business."、Ah! He had promised the ducks not to talk. That's why this happened to him. We should remember never, never say anything at inappropriate times because it could lead to disaster. All right, guys, did you like today's story? We、yes. loved it. Yes, yes, it was <laughs> wonderful. We learned、I、many useful things. Yes, good things. I didn't like the ending though because something bad happened to the turtle, but it was his own doing, was right? Yes. yes. It、well,、so、if you don't mind, I'll go attend to my dinner before it burns again. Okay. You'd better go、okay. back to your business, or if you have nothing to do, play together. I'll join you later. No, I don't want to play. I have、yeah. a lot of things to take care of. Lots. Good. Lots. Of okay. okay. All right. I'm leaving then. Take care. Bye.